Josh. Josh. Yeah. Bro, uh, are you ready? Are you ready for more amazing military TikToks that make you laugh and cry and go hee 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 hee? Wait, military TikToks? Yeah. Is this because of you having uh, America Day or something? Yes, it is, in fact, the 4th of July. What is so special about the 4th of July? Why do you all get so hard on the 4th of July? You take that back. I'm oh, sorry. I'll go outside and shoot a neighborhood cat just to appease my American god. Does that make things better? Yes, thank you. <laughs> all right, show me some wacky military stuff. I want to, well, first of all, can I just say? Yes. Thank you for your service. Um, <laughs> Same thing with this first TikTok. You will thank them for their service, 100%. Show me some good old American humor. By the way, this is super fun because we're going to be reacting to military TikTok today. I am also a veteran, so this will just be hilarious. All right, here we go. This is what happens. Thank you, just thank you for your service. Thank you for your future third okay. third. I greatly appreciate it. Whoa, whoa, dude, at ease. I haven't even finished basic training yet. Thank you for my service when I'm out. Hey, oh. soldier. Thank you for your sir. Shut the f up. God damn, this shit's annoying. You paid the ultimate Beep. sacrifice. <laughs> and after the war, they got you, but. Beep. Whoa. Oh, he's dead. Beep. Oh my god, it's bringing me back. So, essentially, Josh... Explain to me what just happened. Is that, like, the stages of life for a military man? Yes. Essentially, very quickly, when you first get in, you're proud to be a soldier. You're like, oh, someone thanks for your service. You're like, thank you. I, I appreciate it. And then realize down the line, and it's just like, thanks for your service. You're like, shut up. I don't care. Thank Whatever. You know, you don't really mean that. You're not... You're just saying that to say it. Shut up. I thought I understood the military lifestyle, but at what point do you get wrapped in a giant burrito? Oh, uh, so that's... I wasn't really up to date on that part. Yeah, that's that's later. That's when you spend 20 years and you retire. 100%. Then you they just wrap, get wrapped. They wrap you in a tortilla. They wrap okay. you in a tortilla, and they give you a DD-214, and they ship you back to the States where you can not have free health care. Okay, well, I understand that part. Yeah. But what is the part where they stick tampons in your nose? That just might be a marine thing. We don't... We don't... We don't talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> They're built different. They're literally built different. All right. Okay. Found this in my drafts. Okay. We're new. We don't know what to do. Look at him standing up, pray dress. Acting like. <laughs> Where did she come from? How'd she do that? <laughs> All these new f***ing people just got to the unit. They're like standing in a parade rest. And they're just like, oh, look at them. Look at the little babies. Look at them standing there. And then an NCO pops up. She's like, turn that shit off. Oh, she like well, their uh, like she's dad the, or something. Yeah, she's the NCO. So like whenever you see a sergeant or higher, you stand in a parade narrative, rest narrative, for them. Narrative, narrative, narrative. Slow down, brother. What does NCO mean? I non thought that was like a boy band. No, it stands for non-commissioned officer. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I understand. Yeah. And those are all like freshmen, right? And they're all es like new. Essentially, they are they are brand new baby privates. Yes. Okay. They don't know what to do. They don't know how the world works yet. They don't know that they signed their life away and they have no rights. <laughs> Join the military, ladies and gentlemen. We'll pay for your college and promise you a Camaro at 55% interest. You would have made a great sergeant, drill I, sergeant. I, 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 I honestly, I actually almost became an NCO. They wanted me to stay in just for another year. But if I did that, I would have had to go to Poland for seven months again. And I told them to f themselves. <laughs> I think everyone does that. 100%. To go to Poland. 100%. That's a challenge for you. Oh, Jesus. We are going to test our military bearing right here. All right, you can't okay. laugh. Whoa. Giga military. That's like Buzz Lightyear, man. Did you see that guy? Oh. Holy. It's like they applied the stretch filter to the first guy, man. Dude. Holy shit. That is the look of a man that has gone through a caffeine addiction, a alcohol addiction, two divorces, and his dog died yesterday. <laughs> Actually, it looks like the man who's gone through Nikocado Avocado sitting on his face when he's laying on his back, dude. dude Just pancaked it. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm glad I get to show you this world, Josh. I can't wait. Marines versus toddlers. Oh, I've been waiting for this video. Finally. Yeah, dude, dude. Marines versus toddlers. You ready for this shit? This is what the government is going to enact now that they've made abortions illegal. Hell yeah, brother. My, my man. Bop. <laughs> get the hell out of here. Oh, they're just playing like Nerf gun. Yeah, wars. yeah, yeah. Oh. They're just having fun. They're just having a good old time. But his battle buddy got hurt. She just pops the kid without even thinking twice about it. I thought that's how the government was getting rid of unwanted pregnancies now. My mistake. Josh, no.
What? No. You gotta do it somehow. I mean, technically, it's all taxpayer money, so I guess you're kind of right. Any. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Why is that guy like a military soldier but smaller? What do you mean? He looks tiny. Look at him. He looks like Wee Man from Jackass. Dude, anyone can join, Josh. He's got to be strong enough. Even Santa's elves, Even dude. Santa's they... elves, bro. I... Okay. Look enough. at this. Watch. Watch this video and tell me if you think size okay. really mattered. Okay. I don't know about you. This is really sweet. But size don't matter in the, the army. army, bro. That's cute. I can't wait to see how he looks wrapped up in a tortilla with a tampon shoves up his nose. Dude, that's in, that's in 15 more years, man. He's all he's getting there. That's how they trap you, Josh. That's how they get you. You go in for a couple years and you're like, ah, what's a couple more? And then you go in for another, and then you get to 10, and you're like, well, I'm already halfway through. I might as well go to 20. Yeah. That's how I get you, man. It's so bad. Military pictures are somewhere I have no comment to. Yeah. Yeah. So these okay. are just some cool military photos I wanted to show you. All right, Josh? Let me know yeah. what you think. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, no. Battle kill. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> What is going on on these bases, dude? This is supposed to be the most advanced military in the world. And there's like literally pictures of horse soldiers. Josh. People trying to punch poo out the ground. <laughs> Josh, I gotta let you know, bro. The military is a bunch of fucked up individuals, bro. Oh, we, Jesus. We gotta do anything we can to make sure that we have something that's funny and entertaining, bro. But it's such a fun time. From an outside perspective, it looks absolutely foul and disgusting. But when you're in it, it's just a bunch of dudes. Just a bunch of dudes messing around. Just a bunch of bros doing bro things, dude. <laughs> It is hot as hell in this funky ass, hot ass room I'm in. Is that the Grim Reaper? Don't you be messing around, you goddamn maggots on my base. This is my goddamn granddaddy's base, and he'd be turning over in his grave and he's seeing you flim flom tutu wearing fucking boofters dancing around like that. Is that pretty much what that would say? Dude, I'm super proud of you. That's literally Thanks. like, that was genuinely super close to how that would happen. Either that, like he walked in, notice he didn't say anything. He just kind of <laughs> stared at him for a little bit. That's the motion of just like, <sighs> you're about to get fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you know what you know what you did. Same look You're I did my dog when it shits on the floor. Yeah, I hope you're ready to get punted through the closest window, basically. <laughs> exactly. This is me after being in the military for only four months. Hello, mom. Yeah. Can you come get me? People are getting engaged. <laughs> What? The way, do, they, do they mean like engaged in no, marriage or engaged yeah, as in, in, in firefights? In, in marriage. So a huge thing, Josh, is that as soon as mm. you get to like a real unit and everything, you mm -hmm. find out you're in a barracks room, which is like, I would say, you see how, you know how big my office is, right? Yeah. Imagine my the size of my office cut in half. That's the bedroom and that's where you live. But if you get married, you can have a house or like a townhouse apartment, like a big one. So oh, usually- People start getting married straight away. Yeah, you'll see a whole bunch of 18 year olds, 19 year olds going like, I love you, Jenny. I love you with all Wait, my is heart. Is that actually a thing? Yes. So the military kind of actively encourages you to get married. I mean, they don't encourage it, but they I mean, they show don't you encourage a, it, but like they, they show obviously, a lot like, of benefits of getting better. married. You get better pay. Really? You get better housing. Well, you get better pay if you're married. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Holy shit. That explains why it happens so much, I guess. Yep. A lot of high rates of marriage and divorce there, Skippy. They're just jumping straight into that shit. They're jumping straight into it. Because why'd you join the army? Wait, shit. Was I was in Home Depot working, but they told me it's like when I get the green card, I you, you need to join to the army. So that's what I'm here right now. That's a million likes. That a is a million. Yeah. Oh yeah. Because there's that's lo lots of real lots of green cards getting handed out. Yeah. For the military. Yeah. If you serve a little time in the military, you're automatically a citizen afterwards. Really? Yeah. They'll give you your green card right after that. Oh yeah, brother. You can see how there's lots of benefits to joining the military. It's what they promise mm. you. It's how they get you. Oh my God! Don't you just love the water? We should just like take our clothes off. Water. 
What? <laughs> F- you, army. So. I have so many questions, too. Okay. So explain it to me. Let me I'll run it to you really quick. Navy is on the boats. Usually anyone who joins the Navy, everyone thinks that they're kind of, you know, fruity. The Air Force is known as pogs. They don't do they don't ever do anything except for stay in an air conditioned office. They never want to go outside. Marines are brain dead. Space Force is even more brain dead. Wait, wait, you actually have a branch called Space Force? Did you not know about the Space Force? Are you joking right Josh. now? I don't know if you're joking. Josh. Hang on, I'm gonna Google this. Josh, it's real. It's real. Space Force sounds like a fucking Netflix original, dude. It's a real thing. It is a Netflix original. Wait, they have a United Space Space Force? United States Space Force? When Trump was elected president, he invented the Space Force. Are you serious? Oh my god, you're right. I'm you so were right. Serious. Trump made the Space Force. I'm so serious. He made it in 2019. Oh my god, they even have a logo that's like Star Trek. Oh, what yeah. the f Imagine being in the Space Force. Dude, what, what do you even do? I wanted to call and ask actually a recruiter about the Space Force. Be like, I'm ex army. Sh shoot at the sky and stuff. Do, you don't, what do you shoot anyway? But yeah, army is like another. We're all grunts and ground pounders and shit. Coast Guard always gets shits on because it's also like they also don't do a whole lot. But now they're in the water, so now they're like. Yeah, okay, yeah. Okay. So so now you kind of understand the branches, away, but right? A space Force. Dude, I yeah. I know, man. Josh, I'm oh sorry you had to find God. out this way. <laughs> How do you pass the time, brother? So they shoot each other. Yeah, with Nerf guns. I mean, whatever whatever you can do to pass the time, really. I don't In know. In the Navy, I, they shoot each other, too. Yeah, just something else. Uh, sperm. Uh, sperm. All right. Got a crayon, like always. What the? F there you go. Wash it down with some. Yep. Okay. There you um, go. Any retards. Got it. Yep. Alcoholism. Yep. Oh, and they like drinking. Yep. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Narrator. <laughs> Navy is gay. Yeah. Then, All right. Yeah, now I'm yep. starting to understand. You're starting to get the stereotypes. I'm. I'm so proud. Starting of Starting to get understand. All the military branches are great, but what's the strongest thing about you guys? Huh? I think yeah. big poops. So my butthole is very strong. Oh, my knees, bitch. My knees strong as f I be changing my f every day, I swear to God. Oh, I'm ready to <laughs> Use the word strong, which we don't possess in any physical sense, oh. but we are strong with knowledge. Strong as f The yep. love I have for my friends and the power of my hugs. You want to know how strong we are? Army strong. <laughs> Should never <laughs> Army okay, stuff. I thought I understood. Now I'm confused again. Why are you confused? I'm confused why they put tampons in the nose. No, that that, that was for like when you're like oh. in a hospital. Okay. There you go. And you don't want to bleed out the nose. Yeah, there you go. It required zero brain power for him to give me that answer. Smith, just the person I need to see. Why you join the army, man? Shit, I need money. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, it's short and sweet. I got you. I mean, that right there, this man right here, 90% of the That's reason it. why they invite right. like people join the army, bro. That makes sense to me. Bro, why'd you join the army? More money. There you go. <laughs> money for more Pringles. Some of the weird stuff that Marines do these days. All right, Josh, you ready? You, you've gotten very yeah, good at this. Some weird stuff the Marines do these days. Whoa, okay. And they say that the Navy is gay? Come on. I've I seen mean, more dicks touch butts in the <laughs> army videos so far. You mean the Marines, right? Whatever, dude. Whatever. I mean, here's the thing. The Marines- They got guns, they're American, they're army, they're all army people, whatever. The Marines are a branch of the Navy, so. Okay, branches grow on trees, narrator. Cut some grass, please. <sighs> I'm cutting grass. Can't get this mother to run. Why won't it start? Oh. Sergeant! Truck won't go. I know what's wrong with it. Ain't got no gas in it. What? It's bogged, you friggin' <laughs> dildo. I don't know what's wrong with it. Ain't got no gas in it. That dude talks like he's been smoking for 60 years. He man. probably has, dude. You see him? <laughs> it's not mouth to mouth. It's mouth to stoma. Dude sounds like Beetlejuice. Yo, that's some bullshit, bro. What the f***? Where's Marine Corps at? I know his ass in here. Oh my god, it was all the lust. <laughs> it was worth it though. It's nice and hot in here, sweaty. Sweaty, I like it. Where the mask is at? 
Okay, it is way <laughs> too hot in here. We're fan. We need a fan. And where are the hotels at? Okay, I'm not doing this. <laughs> Raw. <sighs> Raw. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, it's so nice here. Everyone else is probably in hell. Yep. Hey, Space Force. Hello. I brought my potato. Literally not an evil bone in their body. They're the new baby brother. They're kind of special. The special Space Force. Special Space Force. I brought a potato. Out of all the things so far, this gives me PTSD. What? What are they doing? What the hell is... You have to explain to me what's happening or I'm going to freak out. So, Josh, wherever there is a alarm, right? Usually it's a cannon shot in the morning and then they'll play a song and then there's one song. They'll play it again at like 5 p.m. During that song, whatever the f*** you're doing, driving a car, outside doing anything, you have to stop exactly what you're doing, wherever you're at, stand in position of attention, which is just straight, and you have to look at where the sound is coming from and wait until the song is over, and then you can continue what you're doing. Right, okay. So that dude was like crawling under the rope or something. He was literally in the middle of crawling under this rope, and he has to plank. They can't move. Whoever took this video is a mad lad. Man, America's weird, dude. Dude, the, the military's ar weird. The army's weird. Next next time I bring you on, I, it'll either be you or somebody, but I'm about to I'm never show you. Back. No, you're coming back. You don't have a choice. I'm never coming back. No, I don't have a choice. It's in Space Force underpants. I support the Space Force. Do you support the Space Force? I support the Space Force. Well, all right, Josh. <laughs> Holy shit. Thank you so much, everybody, for staying to the end of the video. If you did, if you watched to the very end, you're amazing. No one can take that away from you. Thank you so much. Josh, do you have any final words? Space Force. Beige voice. Make sure you leave a like on the video. Love you all so much. Bye, honey bunches.